Okay, wintry precipitation again this weekend. The temperatures are staying below freezing overnight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's send it out now to meteorologist Chelsea Ingram for our forecast. Hey, Chelsea. Certainly some slick spots can be expected on the roadway, that's for sure. And some areas saw some significant ice accretion up to around a quarter of an inch in Portrait of Anne Arundel County. Very impressive numbers. Looking at radar, though, not so impressive right now, you might say. A lot of the steady precipitation that's moved on off to the north and east. But when it comes to freezing drizzle, very, very small water droplets that then freeze on contact, you can't always see that on the radar scan. So just be mindful. That it is out there, and we'll expect to see patchy areas of that throughout the overnight hours. Look at these numbers well below freezing. So, anything that had not frozen over yet today, a lot of stuff did, but if it didn't at this point, it is likely frozen. 28 degrees at BWI, 26 in Bel Air, it's 25 in Westminster, 28 in Frederick, well below freezing. The only areas above freezing are going to be down the ocean, 36 in Ocean City, and 34 in Salisbury. So, expect some hazardous travel and some very, very slick and icy conditions on the roadway. If you don't have to drive, don't do it. Just stay home. Tomorrow's Sunday. It will warm above freezing. We'll talk about that. Here is the bigger picture. So, this area of low pressure that's moving on off to the north and east out into the Atlantic. So, we'll get some clearing uh, as far as the precipitation is concerned overnight. But again, looking at future cash, just some very spotty freezing drizzle overnight, even into tomorrow morning. Clouds dominate throughout the day, too. Areas of freezing drizzle overnight low, right around 26. Some of our north and Western suburbs will bottom out in the low and mid 20s. Tomorrow, 37. There you go. Finally above freezing. So some melting will take place, but we could still get a little bit of a refreeze on the back side tomorrow night. Again, clouds dominate. It should be overall, though, a much better day compared to what we dealt with throughout the day today. Our next storm system, well, it could bring us a little bit of a wintry mix with this leading area of low pressure. That's Monday during the day. And then a stronger area of low pressure moves through. The good news about this, model solutions are trending warmer. More likely to see rain instead of what did look like a significant icing event. That doesn't mean it's not going to happen, but it means things are looking better for us, but it could still change. So stay tuned on that Monday, Monday night forecast. 34 as we head into Tuesday, slow clearing. Wednesday looking good, 37 degrees, mixture of sun and clouds. Hey guys, we make it up into the 40s by Friday. Over to you.